Hi folks, it's James here and uh, from the Movie Bed channel and I picked up some other stuff during the week apart from the Poundlands one as well and this is over the last couple of weeks that I shall show you now and stopped off at HMV, I think it was about two weeks ago and a, again, discussing 4Ks I was really tempted to pick up the 4K Aquaman but with the discussion we've been having about the Blu-ray and the upscaling, so from the what the uh, 4K really only comes out at 2K anyway, so that much difference and that much difference in price. Well, I've seen Aquaman for £7.49 on uh, Blu-ray, so I, I bought that and uh, so uh, I got that and I said the upscaling, I think I'm, at the moment, unless it's a really movie that's cheap or it's got an older one, I think I'm going to stick with buying Blu-rays from now on. So there you go, so picked up Aquaman for £7.49 At the same time, I've been wanting to see this for a while, I haven't seen it yet And I don't know why I've still not watched it, but I'm gonna And that is Bumblebee, again for £7.49 I've started to buy, I sometimes buy stuff new quite a lot recently That's not really in my money I would budget, but when it's £7.49 You know, that's C that's CEX prices, and for a brand new one, that's well worth it, so picked that one up too and I also got one out of the clearance, and that is classic Jean Claude Van Damme, hard target, hard tar target. I like it Time Cop. I've got Universal Soldier, so I like it Time Cop, and I want to get Nowhere to Run. A lot of people say Blood Sports and Kickboxer are good ones for them too, but I've not actually seen them. So I'm, I think I'll try and uh, beef up my Jean Claude Van Damme collection. So I've got that one, that was that was a good one, and this one, I've seen this one, it's from John Woo, and basically it's uh, rich people trying to kill homeless people for sport, hunting them, and he gets involved, he gets involved in that, uh, and it's typical John Claude Van Damme fashion, he destroys them all. I'm sure that's not a spoiler, because uh, everybody knows what happens in every one of his films like that. <laughs> uh, in the Zoom sale, I picked up... Uh, there was two three, uh, 3D ones for £8 and I picked up this one. I did pick up another couple and traded them at CDX but I kept this one and that's the Secret Life of Pets 3D, Blu-ray, Digital and uh, DVD. So it's got 3D, Blu-ray, a DVD and a digital download so a nice 3 disc edition. There they are, so happy with that. I think I uh, gave the digital code away on Big Polly's uh, Facebook page, so if you're, any of you haven't joined that, it's mainly for UK people, but if you go on to Big Polly's uh, chat movies, people on there talk about movies, see what bargains they've got, share what bargains they found and perhaps where they, where they can uh, get them for you, and also there's the occasional people that give away the digital codes on there, so you might be able to get one. All I would say about that is, you know, we put the digital codes up, I put four copies of Secret Life of Pets digital, digital codes up, just be polite, okay? If you've taken it, just say thanks and I've taken it. That's all you need to do, because there's people in there that don't, uh, or there's people that just don't do that and then they can why they do that. Why don't you just say thanks, I've got it. Sorry, that's a rant. <laughs> so I'll see, show you what else I've got. I also picked up in the Zavi sale an Arrow Steelbook of The Bride of Reanimator. And I picked it up for, I think it was 9 99 but with a code you got it for 8 99 so I picked this one up. The only thing is, I've never seen Reanimator, so I can't really watch Bridey Reanimator. I think this is the second one uh, until I see the first one. I don't know if Arrow have got a release of Reanimator or not. Perhaps somebody can let me know if they have, uh, so I can do that. So, oh, better take off the uh, J card and have a little look here. Let's have a look inside. So it's just a single disc. Nice artwork inside. Is this a wee booklet or is it a poster? It's a booklet. So you can see some. Oh dear. You can. I'm gonna. You can see some of the things on that. Look at that. I'm gonna get censored from YouTube. Look. <laughs> so Bride of Reanimator. There you go. Uh, so obviously I need to see Reanimator before I see Bride of Reanimator. Uh, on there, so I think I'm going to have to wait for it to watch that one. Put that J, back, that J card back together. 
as they call it. Uh, so I picked that one up so that'll help me with my arrow collection. I was in the Bethany shop and just coincidentally and luckily they just started to put some Blu-rays out. Usually they charge about 250 for a Blu-ray which is alright if it's a good one but if it's something like Hurt Locker or you know one you can find for 50p in CX they're just going to sit there for ages. I've actually seen loads of them sit there and almost a year they've sat there for some of them. Uh, but they just happened to put these ones out and they hadn't priced them up yet so I asked the lady how much they were and she said £1.50 so I was like okay that's a pound less than usual charge so let's see what they've got for me and I picked this one up which is Prayer Before Dawn and it's about a bare knuckle street fight in, in Bangkok so boxing one and this was one I actually put that one back down and then because it was £1.50 I picked that back up because I, I probably would have paid £2.50 for that but Maybe I was wrong. Maybe you can let me know if anyone's seen it. But I picked up Fair Before Dawn. I also picked up A Cure for Wellness. And this looks just like a, like a nice horror one with a slip cover. Some nice disc artwork as well. There you go. Again, I'm never going to get around to watching all these movies. Maybe when I retire. 25, 27 years time, I'll be sitting watching these. Will Blu-rays even be about then? It'll be some other fancy format probably. But I'll be still be sitting like the old guy with my video going, This is great technology, it's perfect. <laughs> That's what will be happening. Uh, what else did I get? Oh yes. Two ones that, I said that, that were in CX and I was eyeing up. But they were Highlander was listed at eight pound in CX, so classic Highlander. Can he beat that? I am Connor McLeod from the Can Clan McLeod, and Sean Connery, and he's so sort of playing. Even though he's Scottish, he's playing the Spanish guy. And Christopher Lambert, I don't know what, what is Christopher Lambert, French or Belgian or something like that, is he? Uh, and he's playing. He's playing the Scottish guy. Hey, there you go. Bit of role reversal for you. So classic Highlander and up again for £1.50 when that was 8 in CX. So happy with that. And really happy to pick this one up. Another Gene Hackman classic, Mississippi Burning. Nominated for six Oscars. Does that mean it didn't win any? Mm. If anyone knows how many Oscars it won or if it did win any, then let me know. So. Again, for £1.50, really happy to pick that one up. Uh, so now we'll move on to my CX purchases. This is what I'm talking about. You get these ones that are in Poundland at £2 at the moment, and then you see them in like CX for 50p, which this one is, which is the kidnapping of Freddy Heineken. And I've seen this one, I thought it was, a, it was an okay movie. Uh, but I wasn't a two pound for it in Poundland. I was like, mm, I'm not going to pay two pounds. So it come up, it comes up in the, uh, shall we say, uh, CEX for fifty p, and that's perfect, ideal. Even if you didn't like it, fifty p for a Blu-ray case worth it. <laughs> if you need a spare one, that is. Uh, I picked this one up too, and this is one of my favourite Jack Ryan ones, which is Clear and Pairs of Danger. Winner. It won one Oscar. It won one Oscar. So there you go. What was it? Best Picture? Mm -hmm. It won Best Picture. There you go. No, Best Cinematography. Best Cinematography. There you go. And uh, I wonder what beat it. Uh, so I picked up this one, which is again with William Defoe in it and Harrison Ford. And William Defoe's had a great career, eh? Mississippi Burning, Clear and Present Danger, Platoon. So he was in, he was in Platoon, wasn't he? Spider-Man. Uh, so I picked this one up, and this is a this is a, a great CIA Jack Ryan Jack Ryan one, and uh, I really like this one. So you, you can always tell the movies that 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 are, uh, shall we say, good because it always it doesn't matter. They never drop to fifty p in CX like this one. That's never going to drop to fifty p. Uh, what else did I get? I got who does who is it makes flatliners again? Which did that exit?
Joel Schumacher. There you go. So I picked up the original Flatliners. Do yourself a favour. Don't watch the remake. Well, your choice, but I wouldn't watch it. And uh, there you go. So the original Flatliners with Peter Sutherland again for three pound. And I say when when the, these are uh, the X ones, m most of the time it's vouchers are used uh, to get them. And a David Cronenberg for called Dead Ringers. I just got to with David Cronenberg and I like the cover with Jeremy Irons, 1989. So again. I picked that one up. I don't know much about that one. If anyone knows anything about it and they want to share, then feel free. Has it got any nice disc art work? It's ITV Studios. No, it's just plain. Dolby Digital, Region B. Looks okay. And I actually had run out of vouchers, but when I went to the CX and I seen this movie, I wasn't going to pass it up. Wasn't gonna, wasn't going to pass it. Yeah, on there, and that is an actual. Once I put David Cronenberg's back together, at least it doesn't seem to be what they. This case, see, this is why it's worth buying the 50B cases from uh, CX. That was decent, that's fine, it's went back together. So, I picked this one up with a slip, and I was like, it was £5, but are you going to get this cheaper than £5? Probably not, probably not. And it is. Classic Beetlejuice with Michael Keaton. It's Gina Davis and Winnie on a Rider. I forgot who the guy is. Who the guy is the dad. Can I remember? Oh yeah, I like Baldwin. How could I forget that? So there you go. And uh, <laughs> always like how they invite you the boss over, and it's the guy. It's the evil guy for Howard the Duck. The no, not the evil guy, the guy that gets taken over by the evil guy, the scientist one, with a moustache. Somebody put in the comments what his name is. <laughs> so again, look at that, as well as, a, as well as the nice slip, nice this artwork. So, there you go. Special features, exclusive Blu-ray bonus soundtrack. Three hilarious episodes from the animated Oh, there's three episodes from the animated series of Beetlejuice on here. And a theatrical trailer. And a nice, really nice, iconic moment slip from Warner Brothers. Worth £5 in anyone's money, I think. So there you go, there you go. Uh, so, in the next couple of days, I'm probably going to not be here for a little while. Or not be doing so much hunting. But I uh, hope you've enjoyed uh, it so far. I seem to have picked up uh, you know, another few new subscribers, so my channel has grown slowly. If you are watching and there is, uh, and you are enjoying the content, if there is anyone you want to recommend subscribe to, I appreciate it, because I would like to increase my viewership as all people on YouTube would. But the main thing is, when we're doing that, we're talking about movies, sharing deals, things like that. I hope uh, I did share the... PlayStation Mini one for fifteen ninety nine on Big Polly's chat and movies, and a few people picked pick that one up. If I do see any more deals, then I might just do a very short video and let you know. Oh, saying that, there is a sale on at the moment of one o one films, and they have got some classics in there. There is one that I quite fancy, and that's Solar Warriors. It's six pounds. It trades in for about your six pounds as uh, in CX, so that because uh, you know when that, these deals come up, I look for ones you can trade in and get more mu more money. Doesn't seem to be any name, but there's Solar Wars for six pound. There's Toy Soldiers, which is another classic one on Blu-ray for six pound, and there's a good few others. So check out their 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 site, One on One Films, and uh, if you spot any deals, please mention it in the comments to me or on Big Polly's Chat and Movies on Facebook group on Facebook. Thanks, guys.